Francesco Frugic, congratulations. Gold in the two-man race here in Segulda. Tell us about today. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, today was was other conditions than yesterday. Yesterday it was a little bit softer and a little bit warmer. Yeah, and yesterday we, with our start um, failures or mistakes uh, there, we yeah, you can try free and you make much more mistakes than today. Yeah, and we are happy today. We make a good race with Brett Hall. He did his job very well, and we are happy too that the Latvians are on the podium here in his own track. And Torsten back in the in the sled and back in uh, a victory. This is Francesco's 60th World Cup gold medal. How many of those have you been a part of? Oh, I don't I don't know. Um, maybe 40, 43 or something. I don't know. <laughs> I have to look it up. <laughs> it's been a good partnership. You're looking forward to continuing after Beijing together? Yes, of course. Um, we will we are planning to to do a few years. We will do a four-year farewell tour, I think. Um, <laughs> we will see. No, um, as long as we are healthy, I think we will stick together and do this job. And Francesco, yesterday the conditions were different. Today they were different, and that makes it hard to get the sled set up right and to know exactly what you require as a driver. Um, the, the track was harder today and so you, you have to steer a little bit other than, than yesterday and the problem normally was only that the training was like today and yesterday it was a little bit softer and so you have to, to steer a little bit other than today Yeah, and we have only yesterday which was so warm and so yeah, today it goes much better I think because yeah, we, we learned it in the training this week in these conditions and so yeah, we had a good day and yeah, we are hoping all come well to Germany without any other COVID yeah, falls, I think, and yeah, we will see. And we hope right, fingers... they, they, they had COVID, they come back next week. It's already 2022, we're looking towards the games. How excited are you feeling about going to Beijing? Yeah, we are really excited, but yeah, like we see this week, we have some problems with Corona and we, we hope that was the last problems we had this year. And we hope too that next we, next year we didn't have any problems with that, but no one knows it. And yeah, we are so excited. We want to go to the games. We want to make our races there, but there are two more weeks and then two more weeks at, at home. And then we, we go with the flight over and we want to see how it is there 